Good morning, Sproglets. Today I'm going to talk more about frisking. Getting frisked by AF piggers. And what can it do? Well, what it can mean is, it can mean, um, and the way that they can rule it out uh, is the same as what they do at airports. They scan for various things. All of these things that they can scan for, they could scan for on your person, with your person standing at the safe distance at any police station. But if a policeman makes any direct physical contact with your genitals, what it can mean is that you might wander off into a location. <clears throat> a location that then links you as... Uh, public enemy number one in relation to case number whatever. So, you can have the right to say, because this pigger is touching my person and intends to touch my pee pee and balls and, and ass, and they have spent all their day even if the, even even the nicest of them that are what they're thinking because of dumb luck like listen we don't wear leaves over our loins while inbreeding in a garden like you some of us hmm? so track and field sports it's something that nerds don't like to think about is sports but yes if police touch your balls, you can walk in without knowing it to open in pen, open pending investigatory your crime scenes and then be the first one they dive in on. All because of a what uh, a, a couple of nights in the watch house where you got your balls touched. So if they've gone all their day, just imagine the nicest and most well-meaning of the pigs. Going, yep, crime scene, crime scene, sheriff will shoot, crime scene, crime scene, sheriff will shoot. And, I, and then you're off walking and after being at the watch house, you may, without knowing it, just decide to turn, walk this street, walk that street and walk into the regions where they've been still going well hang on we're not too sure about what this was all who was involved in this so let's see who backtracks because we do know one thing the offender always goes back like that's why like how we always go back ourselves to look again like we are like we were in the garden oh leaves 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 So, yes, police state mentality, anti-police state mentality lesson for today, Tuesday morning. Grounds for insistence on the presence of a lawyer if pigs are to approach your premises. Is that in handling you while knowing that you are a person who walks or doesn't drive a motor vehicle? Uh, particularly in that category, particularly as well and additionally in the non-biphobic category, they could intentively be touching your balls to try and make you go somewhere. Now what does Magistralia say about that? Hands on a book cover? Hmm? Do you swear? Do you swear? So, when you think about the reasonings at that factor in here, remember they got the, the Bible there, at the, all the police uh, detention, temporary detention centers, stations, whatever. Now, uh, their whole idea of uh, a freedom, free me to be released, like free me that I might be released, is to return to a state where they're going, well, we were perfect. 
perfect when we were inbred. Uh, we, we were so perfectly inbred. We have no idea how the species survived. I mean, Adam and Eve had two, two sons and one killed the other. That left, uh, that left a father and his son to, to double team the mother or, or one of the other to keep doing the mother. Or, uh, and, they're the one, they're, and they're the ones that believe in the Bible. They go, and to get back to that state of perfection, they had to kill Jesus. So you okay. care. So we have discussed. See, uh, they the psychosexual opposite of a, uh, and I, we've discussed where this Adam and Eve story came from and who wrote it. Uh, they were people who believed it, it was in their above common the common law, uh, their most their most sacred law of kingdoms and maintaining kingdoms at the time was to make sure that the bloodlines of a family weren't polluted or convoluted by mixing it up with uh, a non-blood relative relation. That's the only mind really that when you think about it could be disgusting enough to think of uh, writing the Adam and Eve story to begin with. Now then, yeah. Then there is there's the argument that they could interbreed and merge kingdoms, merge gods, and that's supportive of why like, there are two conflicting accounts of key stories, like uh, and w uh, why all these kingdoms seem to have global flood stories. St uh, statistic heads go, well, actually, maybe does add up to a proof, and they try and say it's what created the Grand Canyon and. Uh, you know all these all these scrolls, but they forget things like well, commoners wouldn't have had uh, even if they had worked out tool wise how to make pap papyrus a manuscript, they would have been legally not allowed to to write. Uh, that's one thing that uh, just having an item called the tree of knowledge of all good and evil can also disclose. <coughs> Um, so you know, getting frisked by Christian pigs, even if they're even if they're touching your nuts in and you're in pocketless satin boxes that they cut the cord off and don't replace, and they cup your ball sack. Even if he's wearing gloves, I'm some something of a misogynist. I'm very select when it comes to men. Uh, the the stance you're in is that it's it's I think heart rate wise and nervous system wise it's worse than having a gun pointed at you when you have the freedom of movement and evasion of the gunshot because they're going for your reproductive organs. Um, they're behind you while concealing their weapon from your sight. Uh, you know, there are factors like that. And so, yeah, what could happen is you can leave. You, you, when you leave, you might think, I need to clear my head after that. Decide to go for a random wand walk and wander to clear your mind. And on the basis of the... Um, extent of contact to your person made by these piggers you will you might retrace the steps of of crimes crime scenes they've had to settle uh crime scenes that aren't uh investigatorily closed as as cases i mean <coughs> they're obviously not giving you that information and in some sort of uh waivers that say well we, co we cops have been investigating here, 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 and here. As a result of us touching your genitals, we are disclosing to you. We've been ex investigating here, 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 and here. So that you may know not to go here, 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 or here. So anyway, they don't do that. 
But uh, so also what they don't do is they don't tell you like which ones when they take the communion wafer on, at church, uh, which ones are imagining that Jesus had because uh, the, remember the words that the communion service uh, ceremony is based on is that uh, he goes um this is my body broken for you. Now if that means that they're thinking straight to the point of his his death. Does it mean that they're imagining him wearing a loincloth when they put his body on their tongue? Um, or is the loincloth off? Either way, whichever psychosexual um, mentality Jesus was most likely to have had back two millennia ago will today be the type of min most minority marginalized group that the pigs who believe themselves to be inbred even if they and 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 if they mix believing that they're inbred with believing in evolution as well and believe in things like you know uh, sports you've got to fucking love sports or you're a faggot or whatever um who are they going to go and bother? What type of people? Hmm? Hmm. And Jesus loved everyone. I'll say. He loves everyone. Hmm. So, I will be getting ready for my lawsuits against the Australian Federal Police here in the ACT and there will be if we can um, some of you can perhaps we'll do a farewell shindig peace now given the advancements in technology there's only one good reason why um, that would want or yeah try to claim that frisking is necessary as a, as a physical interaction and that it, or that it's right or ethical and that is that whoever owns them the office uh, the land plot um, is concealing more advanced tech and they don't want to be alluding to the, the effect of you going well if this is out now like you know like um, when they made the um, the iPhone 1 and then the iPhone 2 and then the iPhone 3 and then everyone thought well what is next and then fuck and then out came the iPhone 4. So, they're kind of still, in the Christian way, they've been more disclosed, dis disclosive of, of concealed tech and agenda with, with their tech than uh, they're perhaps superintended to be. Because we is well beyond 2,000 in it. But no, there's no frisking. See, I mean, I thought even. That's the, that's the annoying part, is I even thought getting those satin Pogolos box shorts, I thought they might. The cord is sewed internally, so it can only be yanked forward. Like. Uh, you, you're going to hurt yourself at the back of the skin of, around, around your, above your butt, um, pulling on the cord. Were you to attempt an act of harm with the cord, you're not going to get that cord out, but they're going, they'll cut it anyway. 
Um, so their you know their margin for error, and it will show up when they have um, essentially kidnapped and abducted by, is that they'll go well, they'll do they. They've got Jesus in the back of their mind, and like I said, basically. Uh, it's, it's like that uh, Stanley Kubrick effect where the monkey finds the, you know, the, sh the, the cube or the, the man-made thing at the start of, uh, anyway, and, and the monkey's in awe of it, it's that, they, but they get like that, your, your, uh, the, 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 all the points where Jesus has clearly been shamed, um, You know, they they can even so they'll consider it. I've noticed that the more I've spoken out against how fascist they can be, they've gone well. We won't aggressively cuff. They've gone off. Yeah, as a, our gesture of kindness. Okay, maybe we'll stop je uh, aggressively cuffing you. But uh, so where the nails in the in the wrists were, were for shame, he was as he was shamed, and then. Um, the crown of thorns was a, a sign of his he's been further shamed uh, but and then the nails in the feet um, crossed legs crossed over and at the ankles and nails through both one nail through both was for more shame uh, so in our head the only part that goes oh Jesus sets us free and this is not shame this is not shame is uh, the fucking loincloth region. So that's why, like, you can wear and you can wear the most. Uh, you probably wear like a, a Borat G string, and they'll still be like, "Oh, we just better check." And then the officers will be check, 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 squeezing your ball.